So, uh, limits as x approaches infinity. Well, first we uh, try plugging in uh, infinity and see what happens. So, we have infinity here uh, plus infinity. That's still infinity in the top. And then infinity uh, plus infinity minus 5, that's infinity in the bottom. So we have an indeterminate form. Uh, so we can't, we, I mean, we can't tell what this is yet. So then we have to use one of those tricks uh, where x is approaching infinity. Um, one of the tricks, I think, was if they have the same uh, power in the numerator and the denominator, then you can divide their coefficients. However... These don't have the same power. If you if you remember the video, it, it was talking about uh, the numerator and denominator being the same power. In this one, they're not the same power. So the only other trick is to, um, I think it was multiply by 1 over the highest power in the top and the bottom. So if I take this, I can multiply by, well, the highest power is x to the third, so I can multiply by 1 over x to the third. And I'm going to do that in the top and the bottom. So that doesn't change anything. But that's the trick, uh, to multiply by 1 over the highest power from the denominator, and you do it to both the top and the bottom. I don't do 1 over x to the fourth in the top, because I'm, I'm only concerned about with the denominator. Uh, that's just one of the tricks, so I'll distribute this in. And in the top, uh, I get 7x to the 4th over x to the 3rd plus 2x squared over x to the 3rd. I'm really just putting it in the denominator for each of those terms. And then same idea on the bottom. Uh, 3x cubed over x cubed. And then plus uh, x over x cubed and then minus 5 over x cubed. Now I'll simplify. Here I just get an x in the top, so I'll have 7x plus, uh, that's just an x in the bottom, so 2 over x, and then those cancel. One over x squared minus nothing happens here. So if you if you looked at the tricks, uh, one of them was a, the conditions was a, they had the same power. That's when you look at the coefficients. Here we don't have the same power. We have x to the fourth. That's the power of this, or that's the degree of this polynomial, and the degree of this one is three. So they're not the same. You can't even use that trick. Uh, so we just have to use the other trick. So um, now we can evaluate this as the limit as x approaches infinity, see what happens. This goes to infinity. Uh, this goes to infinity, and anytime the denominator is going super, super large, the whole entire thing goes to zero. Same with this and this. Both of those go to zero, so I'm left with infinity over three. However, this is not an indeterminate form. This limit doesn't exist. I mean, technically, but we can say it goes to infinity. But uh, it's it's not an indeterminate form, so this is the answer. Hopefully that makes sense. Yeah.